The reading today is Jeremiah chapter 29 verse 11. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and a future. Well, I love to travel and I think it started really when I was in my early 20s. I went to America for a year with a couple of friends and we met some wonderful people and had some great adventures. And since then, I've been to some wonderful countries and I love a guidebook. I love to get a guidebook and I love to plan my trip, where to go and where the best restaurants to eat. And of course, this year with COVID-19, we've not been able to make any plans, have we? And any plans we did have, most of them have been cancelled or rearranged. And um, we don't like it. We like to have plans to look forward to and events and, and places to go and people to see. And it's been really difficult for us. We've had this disappointment all the time and uncertainty. And we can't look forward to anything because even if you make a plan now, you're not sure whether you're going to be able to, to do it or not. And But God has plans for us. And we don't always know what, what they are. My 23-year-old self in America would never believe that she would be here now in this position, living the life that she's living now. She would never have believed it. And one thing I always say about my life is actually I had plans, but when I compare them to the plans that God's had for me, my plans have been rubbish. So I'm glad God had other plans for me, but he does have plans for us and he rearranges our plans sometimes, which has happened to me. And that does make us feel a bit uncertain and a bit bewildered sometimes as to what his plans are for us. But, you know, he won't disappoint us because his plans are to prosper us and we can look forward to whatever his plans are for us, no matter what we think they may be or should be. But we can look forward to them because they are plans to make us prosper and to do us no harm. And we do have a future and a hope with God, no matter what is going on in the world. Now. Nostrada la carta de vinos. For those of you that know your Spanish, that's can I see the wine menu, please? 